They are what they are. You're real cute. Do you even have Kate Mark? That's not. I don't blame you, Victoria, but you know Kate had a church group and that she didn't party. So why did you send out that video? Oh God. I swear we weren't even going to do it. Then we had some wine and got stupid. More than stupid, it's mean, hateful. Kate never did anything to you. And that didn't stop you from taking one last video of her on the roof. I deleted that from my phone. Maybe I'm not her friend, but I didn't get off on Kate attempting suicide. I'm not evil, Max. Okay, I believe you, Victoria. But you're on else. But I don't understand you. That makes both of us, Max. I always feel like I have to overcompensate. For what, I have no clue. I'm only here to become a photographer, not president. You have talent. You I suck! Have talent, Victoria. You... No? Yeah. Ma yes, you are... Hard to believe. Good. I have real friends. I wouldn't want a fake one. What? Like oh! <laughs> you took a picture of me covered in paint. <laughs> Who do you think set up the paint can to fall? It wasn't Samuel, dumbass. Oh and shit! He crashed my room after, so stop whining. You did that? You bitch! You could have killed me with that fucking can. I almost got that freak Samuel fired. And that would have been bad. You're right, Victoria. Uh, for once. Okay. You actually think you're better than me? No fucking way. We are Guess I'll never be a member of the Vortex Club. No, bitch, you won't. Okay. Who am I? It was good talking to you, Victoria. As usual. Eat a dick, Max. You're just jealous of me because I actually do the things you can't. I put my photographs out there while you hide behind your lame retro selfie. At least uh, tell me where Nathan is. Uh, why do you want to know? Principal Wells wanted to see us now. It's no big deal. Then why ask me? I haven't even seen him tonight. Adios. Alright. Okay. I do want to end things actually good with her because... I, know. I want to be friends with everybody, yeah. but she is such a dickhead. I have warned Victoria about Nathan. I mean, okay, she might be let's evil. Let's do this. I don't. Oh. I do. That makes. You don't know. No. Yeah. Well, this yes. is at least how we can become friends with her, even after uh, acting like an ass. Shit. Maybe, but who says we have to be enemies? Whoever makes that decision, that would be us. Well, Max, I don't. Oh, you. Don't want her. Never mind. It was good talking to you, Victoria. Okay, never mind. Yeah. Max! I can't believe you showed up. Why didn't you tell me? We could have dressed up together. <laughs> As you can tell by my But you haven't dressed up, girl. Seriously. Dana, have you seen Nathan around? Hell no, I've been dancing with Trevor. Come on and dance with us. <laughs> Look at Trevor trying to bust a move. How's the end of the world going? Great! This has been the worst fucking week of my life, so I needed to act like a carefree student tonight. For Kate. I hear you, Dana. But I want you to avoid Nathan if you see him, okay? I will if I want to have fun. I still feel sorry for him. He needs help, but not from his family. True. What do you know about his dad, Sean Prescott? Uh, rich? And rich? And a dickhead, according to Nathan. The Prescotts can't buy a happy family or a happy club. Sounds like you're ready for a change. I don't need any club to be cool or have friends. Oh, look at you. Plus, I like hanging with Trevor and his skater friends. No drama. That sounds like a plan, Dana. I'm glad Trevor is with you tonight. Thanks. The boy cannot dance, though. Look at that. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.
I love that Trevor doesn't care how goofy he dances in the VIP section. No more bottles. With Victoria. The Vortex Club? That son of a bitch is not here. Where are you, Nathan? I better get Chloe. There you are. Chloe, Nathan isn't here. Nobody has seen him tonight. He's definitely not upstairs or in the lockers. Damn. Maybe he's hiding in his dorm. Then let's bail. Nathan can't hide anymore. So, you made it. Oh, uh, uh. hey, Mr. Jefferson. <laughs> are you both okay? You look like you're on a, a mission. Oh, uh, I was just looking for Nathan. Uh-huh. I didn't know you were pals with him. I haven't seen him since this afternoon. He he seemed pretty upset. I think he's still quite upset over the, uh, the whole Kate situation. Yeah, that makes sense. Let's talk later, Max. I have to announce the winner of the contest. I do wish you would have entered. You have to build up that resume and portfolio, but I know you will. Thanks. I hope so. So energized. Okay, excuse me. I'm almost gone. Let's get the hell out of here, Max. Okay, okay, everybody calm down. Thank you. Thank you. I, I appreciate it. I, but I don't want to get in the way of the party, but it's time to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes Contest. Before I do, I want to thank everybody who entered their photograph and everybody who thought about entering. It's what? Now this is the most important step in being an artist. Sharing your work with the world. All of you represent Blackwell Academy and everything our school stands for. As far as I'm concerned, you're all everyday heroes. Ew. The envelope, please. And the winner is... Dun 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 what a shocker. Victoria Chase. Oh my god! Yeah. Some people do. Oh. Thank you so much, Mr. Jefferson. It was your incredible photography that brought me to Blackwell, and I hope I can live up to your name and fame. I also want to thank all the students for being so dedicated in their pursuit. And I'd like to dedicate this prize to Kate Marsh. <laughs> she is the you real everyday hero of Blackwell. And I can't wait for her to come back. Thank you. You suck, Victoria. <laughs> oh, yes. Victoria won. Big surprise. I can't believe she blackmailed Jefferson. Oh. Yes, I can. Who fucking cares? Rachel is still dead, and I want Nathan's punk ass now. Me too. Let's go check out the dormitories. Well, we got to talk with a lot of people oh at least. Nathan just texted me. He says there won't be any evidence left after he's done. No. Shit. We have to go to the junkyard right now. I probably missed a lot of photo options everywhere. I photo checked the video. Yeah, well. Oh, yeah, we probably could have taken a photo of the moons from inside this. Is yes, we might swim? Is yes, we might swimming hole? Stop stomping around, Chloe. Right. Just get ready to use your rewind fast if Nathan tries to jump us. Okay, that is one wheel. But now there's only one moon. Okay. There. Damn it. Oh yeah, we got one Kate. He's been coming by a little hard. I have to go, but I also want to have some for the move ward. Ah. Hmm. Max, please hurry. Nope. Okay, fudge. And <laughs> suddenly we were down there. <sighs> oh god, Max, look. She's still there. Don't look, Chloe. Oh! No! What the fuck? <gasps> no. Balls. 
way. Fancy shoes and some jeans. And there we have the murderer. Uh, damn it! So there we have episode 4, Dark Room. Uh, I love this game. <laughs> but I'm a little bit pissed that uh, I couldn't find uh, the photo options. No, we didn't want Victoria. Uh, Victoria didn't believe you warning. Oh yeah, fair. Yeah, that was the first option that we could have. No one got hurt. Thanks for close request. Oh yeah, alright. Oh, that was such a long time ago. Low and beat them on. Yeah. Next. You saved the blue jay and you didn't stop the bird's nest. Where? Oh wait, was that at the beach? That should have. Got to David's file and on the way. Kay help you find Nathan's room. Yeah, she did. You went with Daniel uh, at the, the Vortex Club party. Uh, you didn't leave a message on Warren Slate. Oh no. I could, I guess. You helped Alyssa. We did. Music ending here. And we have the fucking tornado. So we will go into episode five next time, guys. Thank you so much for being with me. Oh, this is insane. I wish y'all a good night. Bye, guys. <laughs>